Norman Collins' novel, London Belongs to Me, is a rich, sprawling portrayal of London in the late 1930s, capturing the vibrancy and complexity of the city through a diverse cast of characters. The novel unfolds within the social and political context of pre-World War II London, blending elements of comedy, drama, and romance to create a multifaceted narrative. At its heart, the novel is an ensemble piece, weaving together the lives of its various characters, each representing different facets of London society. From the working-class residents of a boarding house to the ambitious professionals navigating the city's opportunities and challenges, Collins offers a panoramic view of urban life. The central setting, a boarding house in a bustling London neighborhood, serves as a microcosm of the larger world, where individual stories intersect and reflect broader societal issues. Collins excels in depicting the contrasts between the characters' aspirations and their realities. The protagonist, Mr. Locks, a middle-aged man with grand ambitions, embodies the theme of struggle against the constraints of one's circumstances. His efforts to improve his life are depicted with a mixture of humor and pathos, revealing the gap between his lofty dreams and the harshness of his reality. This tension between aspiration and actuality is a recurring motif throughout the novel, illustrating the challenges faced by individuals in a rapidly changing society. The narrative also delves into the complexities of social class and the impact of economic pressures on personal relationships. Collins portrays the characters' interactions with a keen eye for social dynamics, exploring how class distinctions influence their behavior and perceptions. Through characters such as the aspiring actress, the struggling artist, and the wealthy businessman, the novel examines the various ways in which social status shapes individual identity and aspirations. Moreover, Collins' depiction of London itself is both a reflection of and a commentary on the social conditions of the time. The city's vibrancy and its underlying tensions are brought to life through detailed descriptions and atmospheric settings. The juxtaposition of the city's grandeur with the everyday struggles of its inhabitants creates a rich, immersive experience for the reader. The novel captures the essence of London as a place of opportunity and hardship, highlighting the diverse experiences of its residents. The interplay of comedy and drama adds depth to the narrative, allowing Collins to address serious themes with a light touch. The humor often arises from the characters' eccentricities and their interactions, providing a counterbalance to the more somber aspects of the story. This blend of tones enhances the novel's appeal, making it both engaging and thought-provoking. Overall, London Belongs to Me is a compelling exploration of urban life, social dynamics, and personal ambition. Collins' ability to create a vivid, interconnected world through his characters and their experiences offers readers a nuanced understanding of the period. The novel's rich tapestry of stories and its insightful portrayal of London make it a significant work, reflecting both the challenges and the vibrancy of life in a city on the brink of monumental change.